All right, happy Thursday to you. I'm meteorologist Josh Stone in for John Scalzi today, and we're walking out to 60 degrees right now. For the most part, mostly clear skies down in Venice. I just checked maybe a few more clouds and also some areas of patchy fog. So look out for that as we have the temperature that's cooled down close to the dew point. Humidity at 100%, but calm winds. Winds could pick up to maybe 5, 10 miles per hour this afternoon, but the winds will be coming out of the, in general, the south, which will help to bring in a little more moisture. We haven't seen that in a few days. We've had bone dry conditions, but now the moisture will return in our forecast. Our radar, for the most part, remains very quiet. A little bit of mist and a few clouds, like I said, around maybe Venice, a little bit further south and east of I-75, some areas of patchy fog, so look out for that. Also, some sea fog could be developing, so for the boaters, you're taking your boat out today, just look out for that, especially the morning hours. I think that will all burn off by this afternoon. Boy, they can't catch a break up here to the north of us. They had some snow coming down in southwest Michigan, northern Indiana. This whole system moving to the east around Albany, New York, higher elevations, snow coming down over here in New York, but around New York City, looks like they're going to have some rain in their forecast. But if you're flying out of the Sarasota Brainton International Airport today, going to Atlanta, going to Charlotte, Chicago, or New York, no issues there as we're all clear. So what can we expect in our forecast? High pressure today, mostly sunny skies. See an H on the weather map, stands for high pressure. I like to tell the kids H stands for happy weather. But to our west, we have an area of low pressure, or L stands for lousy weather. And that's going to be coming our way as we get into Saturday. A few showers, then by Sunday, a little more widespread shower activity and even some thunderstorms. Nothing severe, but still we'll hear, hear a few rumbles of thunder here or there, lingering into Monday, and then things wrap up by Tuesday and will dry out again by mid next week. For the beach and boating forecast, expect a southwest westerly wind at 5 to 10 knots. Sea is 1 to 2 feet with light conditions in the bays and inland waterways. Put your sunscreen on today. UV index at 11. That's as high as it gets. Day planner, lots of sunshine in your forecast for today. We're going to top out in the low 80s along the coast. Like I said, inland. Well, it will be a little bit warmer than that, maybe mid to upper 80s, depending on how far inland you get. So as we get into the weekend, well, it's going to be one of those uh, type of weekends where you want to dust off your old Barry Manilow records, maybe the Carpenters. What do you like, Stephanie? Air Supply? Ah, uh, right? uh, ACDC, yeah. Kid Put Rock. Put those records on <laughs> over the weekend because we're going to have cloudy skies, showers, maybe a few thunderstorms. But like I said, this whole system moves out of the way. And as we get into Wednesday and Thursday of next week, the sunshine returns. So we have everything this forecast for you. We have sunny skies, clouds and showers, even some thunderstorms. So pick your poison here. We've got it all in your seven-day forecast.